Hey, I'm Smirk here, and when watching Tier 1 pros play CS2 Overpass, I've seen teams such as Astralis, G2, Big, Vitality, I've seen them all use this new meta, that being a new smoke landing a ramp and a Martov for playground. This u combo is very flexible, meaning you can do a lot of things with it. The purpose of this util is to have a smoke landing at ramp, denying the T-side vision, so if a T-sided AWPer wanted to peek into party from ramp, their vision is going to get skewed, allowing potential CT aggression to come out from fountain, and also a nice cover for you to throw a HEs into it. And you will have a Molotov landing at playground, giving you information if the T's are going fast playground. Looking at Astralis as our case study, as I've seen them use it the most, Blamef is going to smoke off ramp, and he does this by running in line of the corner of this vent, putting his crosshair constantly above these trees, and when he hits the drain pipe on his right, he will run and middle click jump throw. Afterwards, he will line himself with the shadow, put his crosshair on the bottom half of this line on the wall, and run and jump throw as soon as he hits the bench. After this, it's up to you if you want to play a bit more default, maybe do some aggression, or you could do what Blamef and Device does in this round, where they throw a cheats. In this round, Blamef is going to HE playground by getting to this corner, putting his crosshair on the bottom left of the step, and run and jump throw as soon as he hits his bench. Device is going to throw a flashbang, discouraging the T's from going through the smoke. Then afterwards, throws a grenade right into ramp. The grenade that device threw does 40 HP to Bantu. Meanwhile for Blame F's grenade, it was so close to connect onto two big players, just missing out. As a potential suggestion, in device's role, you could have him HE playground to potentially catch these players as they run through the Molotov. It's up to you. And again, we have another example of Astralis using this combo, except in this round, Blame F will play a bit more default and will head towards connector. Meanwhile for device, he pours himself in toilets, looking at fountain, ready for any potential wide swings, waiting for any potential fast players. But with this util combo, you can really turn the heat up by adding a bit of aggression. In this, Blame F is gonna be the first person out and he will jump in right click for this flashbang. This flashbang will land behind the hedges. So as he runs close to this wall, he can peek out safely, not being affected, unlike Vic. As he peeks out, he's able to get the first and second kill onto the big players running through the smoke. For Stan, Stan is going to throw the util. He will throw the smoke, throw the Molotov, and then join Blimef peeking. And lastly, for Device, Device will create a bit more pressure by throwing a Molotov into ramp. He does this by standing in this corner, putting his crosshair to the left of this pillar, holding W, and jump throwing as he runs past this pillar. At this point, it's up to you if you want to stay in a position like this, so as Blame and Stan are fighting, if they need to fall off, Device has their backs. Or if you want to join in in the action, you can peek out a bit more, like Device, trying to look for any potential kills. And from Tabson's POV, he's going to try run through the smoke, get blind, and well, die. And for the ramp players, it's pretty difficult for them to assist. But as I mentioned before, it's not just Astralis using this meta. G2's also been another good example. Similar to Blame F, Nico is going to throw similar util, smoking off ramp and Molotov in playground. Afterwards, he comes to Fountain, throwing a HE into ramp, dealing massive damage onto Skulls. And this is Skulls POV. And meanwhile for Monacy, Monacy will make his way into long, wanting to punish any T's running fast out of playground, like we saw Big do against Astralis. And G2 also used the same Util combo to do something aggressive. Nico is going to throw the playground Molotov, throw the hedge flashbang and peek out, getting close to the smoke. But wanting to get a cheeky opener, Nico asks Hootsie from party to HE the smoke. 
But unfortunately, the AK beats the MP9 and he gets you kinder down to 1 HP. Monacy is going to be the first person peeking out toilets. He runs out to this bench, ready for any T players wanting to run out fast. At this point, when Nico peeks with the flashbang, he jumps onto playground, first looking at ramp, and then switching over to playground, holding Nico's back. And from Hooksy's POV, he's gonna throw the ramp smoke, make his way over to Claw's party, and then on Nico's call, he will HG the smoke. 